my name is Rhapsody, his name is Reader of Retromation, and welcome back! Oh, sorry, my name's Sweet Tim, his name's Cool Tim. <laughs> welcome and back. Welcome back. Yeah, exactly. And you know what? And welcome back, full stop. And welcome back. You're welcome, welcome as back hell. Back to this. And sad news, this is also oh, ending. Wait, wait. I, I would like to announce that every cha every series on our, both of our channels is ending. Mm -hmm. Copper sorry, has finally caught up to us. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Sorry, I did, did you want to announce that your channel your channel's over? I forgot. Uh, yeah, I mean, I wasn't going to announce that for a while, but I mean, if we are going to announce it here, <laughs> then yes, yeah. channel is over. I, I got caught. Oh. Susan put the handcuffs on me. I'm going away. <laughs> God. <laughs> Do we need blueberries for anything? We got so many. I don't think so. Okay. Uh, the spirits are very happy today, so mining has good luck. Um, Bow! But I don't think mining is necessarily anything we need to do anymore right now, right? I, unless we could go to the oasis, which mm. I don't think we can because we don't have the the mine or the bus route. Yeah, it's it's the bus repair from paying off that yeah. uh, that what what is it called? Community money, center bundle. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Indeed. Do you think that we're going to do it? Wait, what? So this is, we're almost done with the second season, mm -hmm. right? Do you think we're going to do it in the third season? Or do you think we're going to need all four? Do we need all four? I think we'll be making a ridiculous amount of money off of the back of these melons. Uh, in particular, okay. because melon jelly is like one of those rare artisanal things. Mm -hmm. So it ends up selling for uh, a lot. It does take a while to produce, though. Uh, so I think, like, we'll be flush with money and actually be able to finish that bundle relatively early. Okay. And with the, uh... So with... I imagine... But I'm curious because of, like, game-breaking things. Mm. With the Stardew uh, bundle... Bundle speedrun. Yes. They do they need all the seasons to complete it? Uh... It yes. I believe you do, just because you can't get certain, like, winter foraging properties or... Uh, winter plants. Fish, maybe? Uh, yeah. Fish as well. That's another thing that you definitely need. Uh, all those are we, pots of wiggling. Are we... I, it, since since we're so spaced out with the record, recording, are we, like... Are we, do we have everything we need for fish and everything for the season? I can't read, so I'm entirely relying on you. That's that's entirely fair. Uh, artisan, fall crops, bundle, quality crops. Okay. Uh, the quality crops, we do need five melons and five corn. Corn is five not corn. just this series, but it is next se uh, season as well. So we can plant corn early okay. uh, after this uh, crop of melons. <coughs> um, okay, good. Animal bundle. Do we have animals yet? Oh, we do. Uh, we have a coop. I don't know if we got. Oh, we did get animals, right? Yeah. Uh, I I forgot about that. I mean, I just went down here, but I didn't even. Oh my god, they're so cute. Rillard, <laughs> Rillard, and Frat Soda. Hell <laughs> That's <yes>. right. <laughs> the uh, who could forget? I can't believe There's you did. There's also some plants down here to water. I. Uh... I think we planted a sunflower and a poppy, like randomly, just to try and complete those bundles. This is the sunflower, I think. Why not? Yeah, no. Honestly, we're fine for everything seasonal, as far as I can tell. Okay. Good deal. What are you gonna do today? If our, if our... God, don't freak it up. <laughs> I just know if um. We have a. If we're going until the bundle's completed and we we miss miss out on a season, then uh, boy oh boy. That's yeah, that, that that becomes a wait until next year before you actually get to complete any of these things. Uh, yeah, it's either wait until next year or well, I guess we're just not doing that, <laughs> which is probably the more realistic one. That that is another thing. There is another bundle in the game now that has much rarer items. That's that's true. Mm -hmm. That's true. When Dang you, old hop. You have to wait until not hop frog. after the community center? Yes, you have to finish the full community center, and then I think you do it effectively just to beat Jojo into submission. Jojo. Okay. Jojo. Sorry. Jojo? Jojo, as in like Jojo March. Jojo, Jojo. Oops, I just cooked something. Oh no. 
All right, so I mean, I'm I'm definitely at a loss for what is smart to do right now. Yeah, I think that makes like, two of us. Uh, I <laughs> I turned in a lot of uh, rewards just to get furniture, and neither of us are really using any furniture. Yeah, I mean, it's worth turning in the rewards because at at thirty we get to go talk to Krobus. You say thirty, and yet I have real bad 40? news. I think it's sixty. It's I said 30, please, game. Can we get a patch, please? <laughs> uh, get a patch date, so that please. I don't look wrong. Oh, boy. All right. Well, 60 it is. Mm -hmm. It's, it, like, honestly, probably the one of the most uh, effective things that we can do at the moment is try and get as much coal as possible so we can make as many preserves jars as possible before the melons come up. Yeah, I'm going to pop on over to the mines again. Wood stone. That's what I was doing last time. I, I do apologize that the mines have kind of become your terrain in this series. Unfortunately, okay. I can't really do the whole combat. No, it's like, I understand. It's okay. It's kind of like, it's a, like, just call all the episodes Stardew's a roguelike now? Exclamation <laughs> question mark. Undermine? Question mark? Question mark? <laughs> Undermine in Stardew Valley! Exclamation point! Exclamation point! Exclamation point! Exclamation point! Question mark. Uh, digressing to your uh, Mojo Jojo reference, what out of the Hanna Barbera kind of Cartoon Network era cartoons were your jam? Oh man, I mean, I didn't, I didn't partake in too many. What, what were they all? Uh, like cow, cow and chicken, oh. and uh, is that Hanna Barbera era? I didn't read. I didn't read. I think it. cow okay. and chicken is Hanna Barbera. I think like it gets used I as the screenshot for like Hanna Barbera's logo. Yeah, I, I definitely watched some some of cow and chicken. I remember being like really weirded out by it, but like yeah. watching it anyways. It it is kind that... of had like a proto Ren and Stimpy vibe to it. Yeah, but not all the way. Hmm. Maybe. I don't know. I didn't watch I didn't watch Ren and Stimpy. I watched I mean, I don't know. I, I watched a lot of Dexter's Lab. Okay. Is not is that that's not Hanna Barbera though, right? It that's might just, not be, but it, 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 it includes itself under the network it? of uh cartoon cartoon. <laughs> cartoon <laughs> yeah. network, I yeah. think actually I said. It definitely fits there. Yeah. I mean, uh yeah, I watched De Dexter's Lab, Powerpuff Girls. Mhm. Mm Stuff like that. All, all, uh, pretty much anything that was on kid, Kids Next Door. All the things that were on at that exact sort of time. I kids Next Door was slightly after my time. Like, I, I saw, Not like, all the really. Flash games for it. But by that time, mm. I was... Uh, what was I more interested in by that time? Probably <laughs> Eminem CDs. Eminem <laughs> <laughs> CDs. Plural. I don't know. That's good. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. You just listen to D12 as a kid who doesn't understand <laughs> any of this. Yeah, it's like, it's, uh, I know other people like this, and it uh, I can definitely bob my head to it, so therefore... I, for I me, it was this. like, oh, complicated lyrical structures. I love this. This is going to be the only place in music I can find these. And then afterwards, I discovered musicals. <laughs> Turns out there's, there, like, uh, a lot of complicated lyrical structures in musicals. We had that. Who would have thought? Where's the Eminem musical? Exactly. That's what I've been waiting for. They I, can call it Eminem, Eminem the M. Eminem the... Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> I'm on board. I'm on board. Uh, and Eminem is played by Elton John. <laughs> okay. They're friends. <laughs> sure. That's nice. It's like, it's nice to hear that people you wouldn't think would be friends are friends all the time. Uh, what, are, what is Can't probably the best head. example of that? Like, because uh, cause they, they constantly pop up on Reddit. Like, like oh, these people are unlikely. Yeah. Wow, I don't know why I just did that voice. These people are unlikely <laughs> friends. <laughs> uh, Snoop Dogg and, uh, and uh, what's, what's her name? Uh, Martha, Marf Stewart? Martha Stewart? Yeah. Yeah. That's a that's a great one. That's a really great one. That's one of my faves. It, it it does feel like uh kind of like modern celebrities, like kind of like uh two thousands, two thousand ten, like kind of gains their fame celebrities, just like 
either generally get along or maybe I'm just following celebrities that I think are wholesome. Yeah, that could that could be. <laughs> that could be. Or maybe everyone just pretends to get along because they know that if they get along with someone who doesn't seem like they would get along with, people would talk about it. Oh, the old longest game in the world. <laughs> It's I'll true. be your friend so that people think that I'm the kind of person who would be your friend. <laughs> exactly. Give me your audience, please. Ooh, I, I mean, I think like the people, give me your people. audience thing is something that would happen like more commonly in like online media spaces rather than like large celebrity spaces. Yeah, probably. But no, I don't know anything. I don't Which... exist in that space. Therefore, I don't know that it's not the case either. That's fair. Which celebrity do you think has the best social media presence? I'm, and oh, when I say celebrity, gosh. I'm talking like B list to A list. Like, oh, none of this, uh, you know, gamer for president, which is, you know, officially the best Twitter. But. Yeah. <laughs> someone, uh, someone higher than the Zed tier. Yeah, I was just watching. I was just watching Phil Jameson stream Hades. Ooh, I did not know Phil Jameson stream. Yeah, he streams like the same kind of games that we would play a lot of Ooh. it's pretty neat oh, it's just uh casually slide in those dms after this uh, episode yeah it seems nice hey phil uh, we're uh, gonna start a series on spy party you interesting Ooh, phil get in there oh. banana bread phil banana bread <laughs> um, i think i don't know i i i don't know i don't i, I don't follow a ton of celebrities because mm. i just it's never been i i follow a lot of people that got omitted as soon as you said b-list okay but like i would i would but i would consider to be like celebrities to me like just slightly lower than that i don't know i mean maybe the uh, i think ben ben schwartz has got a great mm -hmm. presence that but, that is something i was thinking about like there. actually in particular i was thinking is Ben Schwartz any longer C or like, because he's, he's got Sonic the movie now. with Billy Crystal coming out soon, as well as Sonic, as well as another project, I think on Disney Plus coming out at the same time. Dude's in like yeah. nine films this year, kind of like how Lakeith Stanfield was in every film last year. <laughs> I uh, Yeah, he's maybe, I don't know. It'll be his year. Oh god, it's like oh. and, like I've I've thought that for a couple years in a row with Ben Schwartz though, like him working with uh, uh, Sam Rockwell on uh, on that picture uh, and the heist movie, and every single time I'm like, this is the year that Ben breaks and the world sees what I see. Yeah, it's kind of like a weird Great. like th there's definitely like a vicarious element to it, having watched and listened to his content like for a long enough period of time that. I've definitely formed that kind of parasocial relationship. Yeah, you're like, I want you to do well because I want you to do well, but also because I want to know that I had good taste. <laughs> <laughs> I want to know that I was right. Uh, yeah, but also, yeah, I don't know. I get Did it. Put this bear above my bed. Excuse me. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, I sorry. definitely didn't put one bear above your bed. <laughs> okay. I definitely bear? didn't put one bear above your bed. I'm not lying. Is there another bear hidden behind the giant bear? Have you found the uh, the <laughs> actual bear in Stardew Valley? There's a bear in Stardew Valley? Oh, Linus yeah, lives yeah. up in the in the forage. Yeah, yeah. I'm trying to form a better relationship with him. <laughs> That's rude. I what? mean, there's an actual bear. No, no, the, no, no. In the special forest. I, I, I'm, I'm saying bear in terms of slang, not in terms of a a, a, a pejorative. Oh, oh, I, I didn't even. I was just making sure you knew that there's a legitimate bear in Stardew Valley. I, I don't. And I'm not lying. I don't remember what you do to get him, but he, uh, he's in the he's in the special forest. You go there at like I don't know. Hmm. I think you get a special quest really late in the game, and then you have to take a some kind of item there. Why? Gives you something special. I don't even remember. But he, he's like he's got a full on uh, portrait and everything, like a like an actual full on character. Rad. But you, but you can't uh, you can't do too much with them really. It's pretty much just talk to them the one time I think. Have we already been leveling up the axe? Can we go to the Cinderstar Forest yet? I have a steel axe. Is that? that yeah, that. I so that's open. We've been there. Um, 
it, while you have a steel axe, you might want to spend uh, a little part of every day picking up the hardwood in the Cinder Sap, just so that we have the ability to build later buildings. Okay. And it gives you a little direction because I think for the rest of the season, yes. we don't really have much direction outside of uh, water the plants and do not die. I got 21 coal. That's finally, like, a respectable number. Yeah. I mean, 21. I think there's 14 in there, so 35. One more will get us to 36. Well, yeah, one more gets us to 36. It's just whether or not that actually makes a multiple of 8, which it doesn't. It's uh, 32 with a multiple of 8. All right, sweet. You can make four uh, pots out of all that, I think. All right. I also need to start keeping the hay on me so that I can actually feed these ducks. Yeah. And before feeding the ducks, I should probably feed the chicks. Feed the chickens. <laughs> yeah, the ones that we actually have. Oops. The, uh, the, the wheat is done down here. Mm hmm. Uh, we're going to need a silo as well at some point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you, what do you need for that? You need stone, clay? Uh, clay? maybe? I think I'm actually just gonna go with all of my resources to Robin right now and ask her to build one. Definitely bring clay, because I'm pretty sure that's part of it. Because it's, I, I remember because it's weird, and I think I had to go out of my way to get a bunch of it. Clay, clay, clay. Oh my god, I almost went into the wizard's house. Oh, gosh. I can't uh, find any. We're absolutely aching for clay. Uh, <laughs> aren't we all? Oh, 16 total? I don't think it's going to be enough. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to roll the die on it, though. Yeah, you might as well. Ooh. Yeah, well. Found a cherry. Uh, unfortunately, it's not actually needed for any of our bundles, so never mind. I retract <laughs> my ooh. 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 Yeah. That's <laughs> the best that I can do with an impression of that uh, in reverse. Yeah. That's all, that's all I got, too. That, uh, I think <laughs> say, it's... The weirder it sounds, the more believable it is. <gasps> even though it's not... Oh, right. What's going Please. on? No, that's a lost book. Oh. Really? Oof. I found, uh, I found, like, a whole patch of wiggling worms, and all I got was a lost book. <laughs> it's... That's a t-shirt right there. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> oh, oh you a little here? bit more uh, copper for me. Have you ever actually strategically what? used the uh, the spa to heal up your... It's no. Not... It's, so, it's so out of the way. Yeah. It feels like unless you have a horse, you can't really do it. And even and then, even... like, you have oh, to walk no. so slowly inside the spa... Apparently, they have no running on the tiles signs absolutely everywhere on the inside. Uh, I think everyone is going to the Rapture. I think we're playing a Chinese room game right now. You can't find anybody? No one. I just saw, um, I just saw what's her name? Uh, the girl, the young girl. What's your name? Maru. I don't know. I, don't, I can't. I went, I went to the social tab to know. Abigail. But I haven't never talked to her. Uh, Jazz? Jazz? The child. Oh! Isn't that yeah? Name? Yeah, I, I, I guess I've just never tried to actually, like, sound it out or read it out loud. So to me, it's just like, oh, that's the, the J symbol followed by the A symbol followed by the S symbol. I don't know what you're talking about with this Jazz. Yeah, I mean, I never Excuse talked to her, so I, I feel like I didn't really know either. Mm. And I still have not talked to her. I can't read, and I apparently can't socialize. <laughs> no, I mean, half the people... Wait, how many people do I not know the names of, apparently? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I have, there's ten people I have never talked to. That's a solid effort. <laughs> and I, ten people I haven't talked to, and I cannot read. Bring you have to have intentionally some avoided some of those. Uh, yeah, I mean, I just... I could have talked to, <laughs> to... To Jazz. But I didn't. I walked right by her. 
In fact, I tried to grab my sword to swing it at her, but I couldn't do it fast enough. <laughs> what if they just, like, one one patch, they turned on friendly, like, friendly fire yeah. without saying anything, and then somebody accidentally, like, killed the, killed one of the NPCs mm -hmm. in their game, and they felt really bad about it. I love the yeah. idea of, like, a ninja patch like that, but maybe don't even deploy it to everyone. Somehow find a way oh, to only deploy better. it to, like, maybe 10% of players. They'll see, like, the whole, you know, subreddit fury about it and everyone talking about it online. Uh, but then you effectively create a new generation of, my uncle works for Nintendo and he says if you use strength on the truck, you can get Mew. Because yeah, no one was going to believe it if they can't get it themselves. Exactly. Man. I think if I were a developer, I would spend most of my time not developing games, but inventing ways to troll the people who had already bought a game that I didn't meant it. Yeah, that, me too. I would do all kinds of stuff like that. I'd do that and then spend half the time on character customization. Of course. And then the other half on playing jokes on the people who wanted to support my dream. <laughs> <laughs> and then, you know what? I'll give them a, I'll give them a nice exclusive hat if they, if they go through with the, the, the joke. Mm for me to get a nice exclusive hat you get all those achievement hunters going for it it's it's true did you ever play uh stanley parable yeah i did it's, it was a while ago but yeah did you intentionally try and do all the achievements in that game i definitely did more than the base, like just played through it once. Okay, I'm good. I definitely went back and goofed around. I can't remember how much I goofed around though. Mm. I definitely played with it a, a longer than like. It was not at any percent. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but I'll, I'll go. I'll probably go back to it because it's coming out with the um, the complete edition, right? Yes, it Sometime is. Soon. One of the this reasons year, that maybe? I mentioned it. Sir, this year. I believe so. Yeah. You know? Okay. What else is coming out this year? Darkest Dungeon 2, is that coming out this year? Apparently, the when it comes out this year is up in the air. Uh, Fall Guys comes out this year. Um, Fall Guys. Silk Song. Silk Song comes out this year as well. That's, that's another good one. Uh, th it's weird. All of the ones that I have in mind, I can remember like parts of the parts of the, the press pitch for, but I can't actually remember the name of the game because they're not established franchises. Yeah. <gasps> Spelunky 2 comes out this year. Yes. Right? I always thought That's that was going to be last year. I don't know. I feel like maybe it was. But uh, that's maybe crazy. it got delayed. I'm fine with it. Yeah. Delayed. One thing I appreciate about uh, Valve, despite the fact I'm no longer really a you know, fanboy of Valve, uh, is that they kind of disabuse me of the notion of relying on release dates. So anytime anyone tells me the release date for something now, I'm like, yeah, give or take six months, maybe a year, two years, four years, yeah. five years. Maybe it's not coming out. <laughs> it yeah, makes like, me yeah, a lot more okay. prepared. Yeah. For me, I'm real excited that uh, Animal Crossing is coming out. But Ooh. it's probably just me here. There's uh, also a game called moon. Temtem that is uh, coming out. I'm very excited for Temtem. Mm. If I heard the word temtem or if i saw it when it popped up in a subscription feed what i would do is would be click it immediately you know that actually sounds like a really good idea i i would heartily uh, agree that is something that i would do and in fact recommend broadly now of course i have no yeah. investment in this because currently i do not have a temtem series <laughs> neither do you so we are completely no. fine ethically to say that yeah i would i would click that right away on in a heartbeat i would want that person's click through rate to be through the roof mm -hmm. because i like them and also the game right yeah <laughs> my i i designed my character so androgynous that uh that i went to the spa and i immediately tried to enter the wrong half <laughs> was told i'm sorry you're not allowed in here <laughs> Rude. Rude. Uh, I'm actually just gonna use that to recoup my Wait, energy, other than eating all of the fish. 
Do they do they not allow you in a certain room there? Yep. They're uh the oh. uh the prescribed. Huh. Oh, I was gonna get a Oh right. I was gonna get a silo built today, but I can't get a silo built today. Good, I can let myself Wait off the hook for that one. You're fine. It's not another also, situation of Oh I'll, I'll I'll make the watering can today. I guess I'll make it tomorrow. I guess I'll make it tomorrow then. Yeah. I guess I'll make it sometime. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Maybe. Probably I'll before the it. end of year one, at least. Eh. Bit hasty? Yeah, Maybe. you're right. Did you take the hardwood, or am I... I have all the hardwood on me at 61. Okay. Okay. Just in case that was needed. Um, hopefully the melons come up tomorrow, but even then, like, we're going to have to use them to make melon jelly, so... Oof. We're probably a little bit of a while away from making our bag. Yeah, that's fine. I'm okay. Why do you think so many people lost their marbles and thus created the uh, the term? Do you think that they were really being lost more often than a lot of other things? Like it was such a frequent occurrence that they were like, this was the thing that we're going to say now? Well, think about it logistically. If you're going to lose anything, it's very likely to be something that has the ability to just roll the hell away. And is small? They're small as hell, oftentimes clear. I or clearish. I always wanted to play marbles as a kid. I had, I, I had, I had not the, I was not... I didn't have the coolest ambitions. Mm -hmm. I like. I don't know what I you're talking to... about. You just confessed that you wanted to play marbles. As far as I'm concerned, I, out of <laughs> I wanted to. I always wanted to play marbles, mm -hmm. uh, but I like. You just. I didn't know where to start. <laughs> yep, that's a big problem. <laughs> you know, it's, a, it's a it's a gatekeeping community for sh no. Uh, the marble community is very hostile to newcomers because mm -hmm. everyone just assumes you know how to play marbles. Marbles yeah, like, does have a really, learned. really high, uh, uh, what is it, buy-in cost. I'm, I'm still not even entirely sure. Is Marbles an actual game? Marbles is a game? With, uh, but with a very specified rule set? I, I think there are specified rule sets as well. Uh, and I'm pretty sure it's about like flicking the marble at another marble that's inside of a ring in order to knock that marble out and keep so. your marble in the ring. But I might be thinking of Pogs. I think that's right, though. It and might be Pogs and that, marbles. I think that it would often be played for keepsies, as they would say. Yeah. Like if you knocked it out of the ring, then you got that marble. Well, then you never use any good marbles. <laughs> Oh, I mean, exactly. maybe that's maybe that's actually the origin, right? Losing your marbles, you you get mad oh. as a result. Like, I'm uh, mad. I lost my marbles. But then I don't know where the the incorporation of that being like uh, mentally unstable uh, came from. Yeah, I don't know. Because you would get so mad when they took your marbles that you would start yelling at everyone, and they'd be like, "Stop! You just lost your marbles. It's okay." Mm -hmm. And then you would immediately say, the government is bees, and they'd institutionalize you. <laughs> it's true. The government's not bees? The government isn't bees? I don't know. I mean, hearing their microphone recently has been crackling a little bit. Um, for the moment, uh, my name is Ren Rhapsody. The name of the game has been Stardew Valley. Uh, the name of my compatriot here has been Reno of Retromation. There are links in the description down below to everything that you could possibly want in your entire existence. Hopefully you've been enjoying yourselves, and hopefully we'll see you wow. next time. Bzz, bzz. Bzz.